All right, so we all know it is a wardrobe essential, but finding the right bra is often a problem for some women. Some studies have shown that as many as 80% of women are wearing the wrong size bra. It's certainly not healthy for you or comfortable. It doesn't really give you the best look either. So today, our personal stylist, Jill Marinelli, is joining us again with some top tips to find the best bra for you and for your body. So. What are the things we need to keep in mind when we're trying to go to get fitted and buy a new bra? Okay, well you definitely want to get professionally fitted. It's okay. really difficult to try to fit yourself and measure yourself. Right. So go somewhere like Soma where I've gotten all these bras today. Okay. They're a great bra boutique and they have professional fitters that will help you. So and that's at Providence size. Place? Soma is at Providence Price. Okay. Place. Yeah. Um, and the other tip I would say is when you're buying a bra, you want to make sure that it fits you on the loosest hook. Mm -hmm. And the reason is is because over time bras tend to stretch. That's just a natural occurrence. Okay. And so when that happens, you want to be able to move it in a notch and have it still fit you and still get some more use of it. Right. Okay. So that's great information. I don't think a lot of yep. people would realize that. So you were saying earlier too that you may not want to just get measured, you know, once every few years if your body weight fluctuates or maybe you've just had a baby. You right. should get measured pretty frequently, right? I say get measured every six months. Okay. And or with the gain or loss of even five pounds. Oh, because okay. depending on where you carry your weight, that can mm -hmm. actually change your bra size. All right. So you brought in several bras to show us. Mm -hmm. Let's start with this one here. All right. So this is the t-shirt bra. Okay. And these are kind of my four recommendations to the basic bras every woman should have have in their wardrobe. All right. The t-shirt bra, you want it plain, you want it smooth, something in nude. Mm -hmm. And depending on what color your skin is, nude may be this color, it may be a lot darker. Okay. You want to try to match your skin tone as closely as possible so that under a white t-shirt it doesn't show. Gotcha. Do not wear a white bra under a white t-shirt. And it you get the, show through. The, the glow effect through there. Yes. We don't want that. So nude t-shirt bra, crucial item. All right. Now this one I love. This next one here is, like, you call this a what, a convertible, a convertible bra? convertible bra. Okay. And the great thing about convertible bras is you can make them be several different bras. So you're mm -hmm. only needing to buy one. So I've made this one into a one shoulder bra so that you can wear a one shoulder top, a one yep. shoulder dress, and you still have that support. We all know how well it goes <laughs> over when you just wear the strapless and you're right. kind of yanking at it. Yeah. So this gives you the support on both sides. It can mm -hmm. also be um, a halter bra. You can take the straps off and have it be strapless if you need it to. That's great. So it's many bras in one, and I love the convertible bra. All right, now this next one here, we get to turn our little friend around, yes. and this is our Razorback, right? The Razorback bra. And this is a great bra when you have those little tops, you know, in the summer it's great but even in the winter if you're going to a party at night and you're wearing kind of a bare top yeah we never want our straps to show right. especially when we're dressed up for an evening event mm -hmm. so if you have a top that even you might think a little bit of strap shows do a racer back then you're going to be able to show a little bit more skin and not be tugging at your bra straps and worrying about that another person that this is great for on a day-to-day -day basis is people that have small sloped shoulders whose straps are always falling off on their ah. bras go racer back and it stays on okay better. and last but not least we've got our yes. sexy red siren number here at the end Yes, every woman needs to have a sexy bra in, yeah. her, in her wardrobe. And whether or not you're showing anyone else this bra, just to know that you have it on under your clothes can be a fun thing just to kind of spice up your day. All right, well, that's it. We've got our four must haves in our lingerie drawer. Thank you so much, Jill, for bringing those in. I want to let you know if you want more ideas, you can find tips and other suggestions on Jill's website. And we will link you to that at foxprovidence.com.